Hi, welcome back to Colts KRC. If you haven't already subscribed, please do hit that notification bell and hit that like button. Hi, welcome back to Colts KRC. So today I just wanted to do an intro for the flight footage you're about to see. So you'll see that this is what I'm flying. So this is the Feed Me X Day. So see, as you know, if you follow my channel, I had a load of problems. I had this then replaced and that was a few months ago now and I flew it once and that's all I've ever flown this drone, once. So this was, today was its second flight. Why I decided to fly today was because when I flew it the first time I still didn't have much confidence so I thought I'll test it. So the area I flew in is where I normally fly, some t which was sometimes flying, you'll see on videos, but I tend to fly quite close because of Wi-Fi interference or interference of anything. And that's because I'm in a dip. So when you fly out, that you might be 120 metres from the takeoff point, but at a lot of places you're down to about 10, 50, 20 metres. And that's when you start to lose signal. You'll see from the screen recording, I hope it did record, on there that I lost it once at about 450 that way, which is about normal. The only thing that ever does better than that at that end is the Mavic 2. And 800 metres the other way, I brought it back because it was starting to pixelate the screen. You'll also see the return to home, how good it was, I think it was excellent, it virtually landed on the map. So, either, I've, oh by the way, this is all the latest firmware updates. Now, either, my, never, my old one never flew like this one. This one flies stable, it flies nice. My other one's always a bit jittery, even before it flew off. And I, st I, didn't, I, mean, I had faith in it, I just was a bit jittery. This doesn't, now whether this is the firmware update it's just had, or whether mine was an off one, I don't know. So you're going to see the flight, I've recorded it in 2.5, 60k, 60 frames, 60k, 2.5k, 60 frames per second, and I think it looks great. You tell me in the comments what you think below, but my confidence is very high on this drone now, and it certainly probably won't. I was going to sell it, but I'm actually going to keep it now, because you'll see the flight time, I think it was 11 minutes, and you're going to see, I can't remember what it had in the battery, you'll see on the screen, I think it was about 58%. And before I flew, I did a firmware update in the field. So I didn't use my firmware at home. So I used some of the battery then. And I think it's done great. So flew for superb. It was very stable in the air, very smooth to fly. And I think the video footage looks like that returns home was great. The range on the signal back to my phone was about exactly as I expected it to be. In fact, it's better than a lot of drones that I've tested up there. It just, the only thing I'll say that beats it is the Mavic. So. Enjoy what's coming up. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Why not? Come on, hit that button. It's free. Hit the like button. And obviously, if you don't like it, give it a thumbs down by all means. But let me know in the comments. Thanks ever so much. And you have a fantastic day.
So thanks for watching my channel. If you like the video, please subscribe and hit the like button and also hit that notification bell. There's plenty more good stuff coming up.